I'm going to tell you how to stick to the workout you've scheduled for later today and not just forget about it. Plus, watch to the end where I'm going to give you a discount on my newest course. Let's get started. My name is Karen and I'm a body and mind transformation coach for women with ADHD. My mission is for you not just to manage your health or get by or feel good enough, but to absolutely thrive in your fitness, your nutrition, and your overall wellness. So yeah, you can go on a weekend hike and keep up. You can go swing on monkey bars and not feel broken the next day. Or most importantly, wake up feeling like you're actually 30 versus 80. Yeah, that's a big one. So you scheduled your workout for later today and then you totally forget about it. You get hyper-focused on work. You forget to go pick up your kids. Don't forget that. You have to get groceries or you just get so overwhelmed with all the other competing priorities. So how do you actually stick to it? Secret is setting a boundary for yourself. Effectively setting a boundary for yourself. How you're gonna do this is that once you schedule in your workout, whatever that may be, ask yourself this question out loud. Am I worthy of moving my body today? Am I worthy of moving my body today? And if it's a yes, go work out girl, you got this. But in the back of your mind, if you're like consciously thinking, yeah, but there's this voice saying no, or maybe it's a straight out no. I want you to listen to that and dig deep. I want you to ask, why am I not worthy of moving my body today? And then ask why again and again and again until you get to the root. Because this is starting to get into that root of why you keep self-sabotaging, which is probably deep in your subconscious. And we can start to untangle this through this exercise. So maybe you're not worthy of moving your body because you don't want to be seen. Because as a kid, you were you know, made fun of, so you just wanted to hide. And by becoming stronger, losing weight, really owning your body, you're going to be seen and that's scary to you. And that's why you self-sabotage. So once you can uncover that or start to uncover it, I want you now to tell yourself a different belief that feels good that you're worthy to be seen, that you have something to say to the world or for the world, that you're worthy of having a dream body, becoming fit, and it doesn't make you any less of a person. Whatever that belief feels good for you, I want you to start to say that and tell yourself that. And then go move your body tonight. So if this resonates with you and you want to dive in and do this deeper work because changing your beliefs takes work and daily practice then I'm gonna invite you to click the link below on how to work with me in my newest course, which is titled Restart Here, How to Work Out Consistently. And I'm offering you 15% off if you use the code MOVEMENT when you sign up. Now, the big part of this course is a one-to-one -one call with myself where we're gonna get into that, those blocks, those subconscious blocks, and start to have you change your beliefs and work pass them with my help and I'm going to tell you exactly how to do that. And most importantly, it's the last time you're restarting with your fitness because you restart here. Last time you're restarting, you're going to be working out consistently for life so you can achieve the dream body. Now, if you like this, please click like below and if you want to be notified of future videos, of course, click subscribe. I post every week and let's comment below with a heart emoji if this spoke to you and if you made it to the end. I'll see you next week.